Hi Taurus, welcome to your mid-April reading. As always, keep in mind that this is only a general reading. Always take what it feels right and with what does resonate within your own life experiences during this time. If you would like to have a personal reading with me, please contact me through the email I put in the description box below. For the month of April, I have a special tarot offer available at a sales price. And for this month, it's called Game On. And if you would like to know more details about that special offer or any other of my tarot services, just email me. Or if you would like to donate and support my channel, you can also do so by following the PayPal link, which is also down below. So, Taurus, there feels here that this mid-April can present itself um, with a brand new beginning. Uh, into something unexpected that has a little bit of an emotional, spiritual connotation with it. So I feel like you, some of you Taurus are very focused on work or in ending here a project or something uh, in which you have dedicated a lot of energy into. Some of you are really interested in thriving in business or in um, whatever you are doing socially. Um, I feel like some of you really want to climb the ladder. I'm sorry, you're very focused on climbing here the ladder of success. Some of you are growing to become more and more successful, more and more knowledgeable, more and more seen um, as a figure of um, influence. Because the world is here as, a, as your opportunity and I do feel like some of you are if you are not dealing with a lot of different type of people uh, throughout your work or throughout something that you are involved with or I just feel there, there's something here about community there's something here about uh, being a part of a global network um, that for some of you Taurus could be very 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 satisfying Career-wise, I feel like you would be very fulfilled to accomplish something that started perhaps for some of you Taurus as a minor goal or desire or wish. And then you start applying some, 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 some work into it and um, it's thriving faster or it, it, it is exceeding your own expectations of what you could achieve with whatever this means for you. So for some of you, there's a heavy, um, again, a, this, this, the heavy concentration, focus um, in your highest goals. Now, usually this is a card that talks about um, status, that talks about uh, business, that talks about travel, that talks about connection, worldwide kind of connection especially being that you have the three of wands here these two cards together really usually talk about business some type of business prospect that might be coming up during this time and uh, feel quite rewarding some of you might be afraid of um, this being too big or not being able to handle whatever this world energy represents to you to, to bit more than you, what you can chew, you know, uh, it's like not knowing if you are up for the task of whatever this is. Now, as I was saying, usually this is about work, business, travel, ambition, but it can also be when it's dealing more with relationships or when it's dealing more with a personal um, circumstance. The world here could be talking about it could be that some of you Taurus are at distance with, um, you know, either your family, friends, or, or a partner, or you could be meeting someone online, because there's also here this combination of perhaps some of you Taurus being, um, getting to know someone that might be at distance. So it could be a foreigner, it could be through online, uh, an online uh, outlet, it could be during a travel of some sorts or a trip or through negotiations um because there might be negotiations is here is here as well for you taurus uh throughout negotiations you can end up um 
you can end up having here it's basically like as i was saying the focus is in some area of your life and then something comes comes with it that it's unexpected but very good very fulfilling very rewarding very soothing emotional new beginning ace of cups advice self-love open to love receive love give love overflowing of positive healing emotions and this is your advice and i feel like the ace of cups is coming again at the back of something so it's it's like it, it starts or it feels like it's something just about business or about work or about um you know family or just travel or just a regular um a regular circumstance that then again ends up being something much bigger than what you anticipated i keep getting that you might be surprised and even for some of you taurus intimidated with again the um the the length the length and the amount of what something um you know uh how do you say it in english i have uh, sometimes i have a difficulty choosing the right words it's like feeling like something is huge basically and not knowing where to put it or if you can um handle it because i feel like whatever this is taurus that has this type of energy to throughout mid-april is really something that is kind of um helping you to build here more confidence in your own self to help you be more um, aware of your own capabilities, to help you be more trusting as well of the rewards and the compensations that you have waited very, very patiently to receive. So this is also here, the Three of Wands though is in the challenge. So this is a card of uh, something good coming your way, something very, positive that is going to open up here doors options channels again of uh, abundance prosperity success communication relationships but it's a card of patience because it's not yet there the ship the ship hasn't arrived it's coming and you can feel it coming and the focus is a lot on the future and it feels like some of you have been really waiting for this um, energy of the world, which is also about completion and end of a phase, end of a cycle, end of a chapter to happen, a positive conclusion of some sorts. You have been waiting patiently to receive the rewards of something you have really worked hard for. And it could be that you're no longer expecting it to happen. Or you lost a little bit of faith because you sometimes this, this I'm sorry the Ace of Cups is also about faith being connected with faith and divine flow. So perhaps something you have lost faith, whatever that is, as as big and impactful as minor, it depends on your own personal uh, situation. Perhaps something you have lost hope of um, a while ago. I feel you're retrieving it because you will be having reasons to recover that faith that trust i do keep getting a sense that there's something that will have a very huge impact emotionally and outwardly as well so it's not it's like an there's an internal healing an internal um positive event occasion offer emotional response that then it's like pushes you to the world or it pushes you to see how big and beautiful things can really be when you're open to that. I also feel like some of you Taurus have struggled to forgive something. And for those that have been trying to again end the cycle where there has been some sort of emotional uh, turmoil or pain, um, this mid-April offers that chance of making amends with the past and opening yourself to the present um, in a very receptive form. 
I do feel like it's time to, it's like a clean slate and to wash yourself clean energetically for something that was, you know, um, it's like uh, poisonous or, or tainting, you know, the pure, beautiful energy that lingers inside. And I do feel like some of you, so it's like a, this, um, um, some of you were dealing with either relationships or people that really did not deserve you or did really were not, not to say that they were beneath you, but it's like there was some quality here about a situation again pertaining with love or it's like something uh, where you have put your heart into that perhaps failed or just broke you or left you in a feeling or uh, space that was not very positive uh, and then you have perhaps had a, um, a hard time overcoming it the idea here is that you are getting to see how you know huge and limitless love really is and you really are so the idea here of the beneath is like you were trapped into an energy right of love or perceiving love or perceiving connection that was too small in comparison to what truly is and i feel like now you're seeing the whole spectrum of a very beautiful um energy so i hope you have a great mid month thank you so much for all of you that have been liking sharing subscribing commenting and donating to my channel i really appreciate it thank you so much Hopefully, we'll see each other soon.